Well, it was quite a 4th of July surprise at the Marathon oil refinery in southwest Detroit when workers discovered a conure parrot in yeah. distress. And so not only did they save it, but as Jason Colthorpe explains, the bird has rejuvenated the entire plant. Well, here he is. Meet Maverick, that's his name for now. Yep, and he's having a good time at this refinery, but the story of how he ended up here is something. Yo! Rodney King Jr. was making the rounds at the Marathon Refinery on July 4th when he spotted this parrot. What the what? He was looking at me like, help, come give me some water or something. And help is exactly what the crew at Marathon did. I FaceTime my boss to make Hello, <laughs> I FaceTime my boss to make sure he's seeing what I'm seeing. When he FaceTimes, he say, look at this. And the first thing I'm always like, catch it. It gets underneath this trailer onto the axles and it's like hopping from axle to axle as we get closer, it's going back and forth. So you have four grown men under this trailer trying to lure this bird out into a box that we had. So then we got a cover box, slid it underneath and brought it in here. A bird that beautiful and bright, I mean, a hawk can see that thing miles away. So we were kind of worried about, you know, rescuing it more than capturing it. Once they had the parrot inside, they ran to the pet store for a cage. And I showed her a picture of me. She said, oh, that's a conure. She said, that's an expensive bird. So she said they have a special cage for it and special food. We brought it back here, set it up, and released it into this new home here, and it's been a big attraction. It's a morale booster. <laughs> uh, everyone who comes in, they're like, whoa, you guys got a bird? Where'd this guy come from? Maverick certainly is a fan favorite. He's getting more talkative as the days go on. <laughs> But the crew is intent on finding its owner, who was out looking for it before they rescued it. Just like we love it, somebody else loves it too. So to get it back with the rightful owner is probably the best thing. Well, you're probably thinking when and if they reunite Maverick with his former owner, the guys are going to be pretty disappointed around here. Well, you're absolutely right. And that's why they've already decided to get another parrot to replace Maverick and spice up the control room here at Marathon. We're in Southwest Detroit today. Jason Colthorpe, Local 4. It's really great, the energy it's brought to it's all These up. big, strong, burly guys, <laughs> just so passionate and loving toward a bird. I love in. it. <laughs> We've uh, been looking into it. The owner of the parrot was driving a white Chevy Colorado with an Illinois plate, which traces back to Enterprise, so uh, likely a rental, a rental car. Yeah. The guys are just hoping that whoever it is sees this story and maybe gets in touch. They Maybe they will. I mean, with social media, you just, yep. you just yep. never know. Uh, and by the way, if you're wondering about the name Maverick, yeah. yes, because the guys had been talking about the new Top Gun movie <laughs> when they found him, so that's why Maverick. That's pretty fun. Yeah. All right, we'll keep following the story of Maverick the parrot. <laughs>